What is up everyone, hey be Phoenix, how are you getting on? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. Today, I have something very special for you guys, because I got a new very exciting car, which is pretty much the best car in the game I have heard. So, I'm of course talking about uh, the Lamborghini Sesto Elemento Forza Edition. Yeah, I got this for free out of a random normal wheel spin. I was just playing the game to get some more money and suddenly just just popped up. I don't know how, I don't know why, but it's a cool car. It's my first Lamborghini in the game, but it's also apparently very good. Also, Sesto Elemento kind of sounds like a Harry Potter spell. All right, let's check this out. It looks cool. It is pretty much a track only car and then a Forza edition of that. Wow. And it looks pretty aggressive. I don't know if we just leave it stock or if we should even upgrade it. I think it's pretty much close to the max at least. We can make it an X999 though. To make it even better. I wonder if we should though. Like is that what we want to do or... Shall we just leave it as is? I wonder. Let's leave it as is for now. For sure. And we'll see what it is like. I'm excited. Hope you guys are too. And I think we should do a race in this. It sounds good. It sounds very good. Alright. Let's see what this thing is all about. Let's go left for once. I always go right. Let's go left. Ooh. Oh my god. What a car. Already. Hey, what are you doing? Oh my god. Careful, guy. It sounds so good. Oh. Ooh -hoo. Wow. This thing has so much grip. That's why it's so good. Look at this. Look at the cornering abilities. I... What? No way. This thing just has endless grip. How? Is the question. This car is so worth it. It is also, right away, the most expensive car in my collection at this time. It costs like 3 million or close to. Oh my god, I just can't get over that sound. How good that is. How good the car is. How's the inside? Very race-like. Oh my god. Like, I feel I need to break more. Oh! <laughs> Thanks for getting in my way. But yeah, I do feel like I need to break more than I actually do. Because this thing just finds its grip, at least on the roads. Let's go! Come on! Jesus Christ. Out of my way! <laughs> Whoa! It's not necessarily the fastest car in terms of like top speed or even acceleration. But I can see why in a race this car would be quite insane. And I just like driving it. Just the sound alone makes it so worth it. Alright, should we actually do a little race with this thing? Uh, sure. This seems like a good one. Oh man, I wonder if they seriously made this car knowing that it would be as good as it is, or if it's more of a flaw almost in the game, that it's so good. What are we gonna go up against? The 40s, Zonda, Zonda R I think. Alright, FXX I saw at the back. Let's go! <laughs> Alright, yeah, again, acceleration, I'm not the greatest thing ever, but when it comes to the corners, just get out of my way. Oh, yes, here we go. Look at that. Oh, I don't even need to brake. Do I need to brake at all? Alright, had to brake there a little bit. Did end up sliding, and this is, I think, highly skilled AI, I'm pretty sure. 
so it's not going to be easy anyway, but with this car, it's very doable. It just finds its grip, no matter where you are, what speed you're doing. And let me remind you of this, I can not still- oh, well that was a shame. <laughs> I can still tune the car and give it way more horsepower. I hope it doesn't mess with the actual grip though. Because yes, if this car was just faster, but other than that pretty much the same, there's there's no beating it. Even now, with my terrible driving skills, I'm still gonna go second. <laughs> yeah, alright, not first, but hey! That's on me, not on the car. <laughs> Alright, it might ruin the car, but I do want to check it out. I do want to see what happens when we go and tune this thing. Upgrades. I'm not gonna go upgrade it myself, because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> uh, so what I'm just gonna do is find a custom setup. Insane Grip version 2. That sounds good. Again, from Dawn. Of course, 1100 horsepower now. Higher top speed, higher 0 to 60. Pretty much everything better than it was already. Um, I can always remove it if it doesn't work. <laughs> but if it does, it's gonna go quite insane. 100 grand? Hey, that's nothing. I got this car for free, remember? Wish I had recorded my reaction when I actually got it, but again, sadly, I wasn't really expecting anything like that to happen. But the, en the engine swapped it. Oh. Okay. Not really what I would go for, but... Let's see what it does to the car. Jesus, the speeds. Okay. Oh. It has too much grip. I wasn't expecting so much grip. So I actually overcorrected myself. More than I actually had to. Whoa! <laughs> Jesus! Oh my god. I can't control it. Problem is traffic, and not this car, because it just keeps going. Look at that! <laughs> 200 miles an hour through the corners? Not a problem. Oh my... Oh, what? Oh, what? 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 This thing. How? This is what I was expecting, just the absolute sheer speed, while still just going in a straight line. And when a corner approaches, you just go through it, and it doesn't mind it whatsoever. What? Okay. I I don't know how. I, I don't understand how. <laughs> this thing, it's just... What? Okay, okay, well, there was a car in my way, so <laughs> I had to avoid. And is that crashing through a building? Oh my god. I can see why people do the Goliath in a car like this. It probably takes a minute <laughs> to finish a race. And we keep on going, we keep on going, and it keeps on gripping. Again, more than I keep expecting it to. God. Okay. I wish I could just turn off traffic, you know? <laughs> now I can really feel like what this car can do without worrying about there being a car all the time. Oh my god, I wonder what engine it has in this one. Because, again, as I said, they swapped it, I think. Oh my god. What is happening? Whoa! Okay. Alright. Alright. I think we should calm it down a little. Although I don't want to. Just want to keep going. Oh my god, oh my god. Again, it just feels unnatural. <laughs> it is unnatural. But the grip this thing has. Like, you don't expect it every time to just go. And that's what actually ready. makes me crash. Better be quicker, I'm keeping Jesus. it. Go. And go. <laughs> it just does what you want it to do. Alright, we're here at a drag strip. 
I want to do this jump. Because, well, this might not be the fastest accelerating car in the world, it is pretty damn fast to begin with. I just want to see what we can do. Go! Speed! 100 miles an hour, 150. 180, 200. <laughs> I think it tops out at like 270 now, but still. That's just because it's out of revs. Not because it's out of power. Here we go! Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Can we make it over? Very closely. <laughs> 2,888. It's not a record for me. But again, it's because it's not necessarily about the top speed in this thing. It really is about driving and using it. And while I prefer the original sound, this isn't bad whatsoever. Oh my god, I can't, I can't, I just... I can't. This thing. I don't understand how it works. Alright, you know what? I think, actually, I am gonna leave this episode here. I might actually change it back to stock, or at least maybe I should tune it on my own, because I kind of want to keep the engine we had, um, but have it be close to being as good, at least. But we'll see if that is even possible. I am gonna end this episode here now. Very interesting to check this one out. If you have any suggestions for other cars you want me to check out or other stuff you want me to do, let me know. But I will be back with a few more Forza videos, for now at least. But anyway, this was your Phoenix. I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe now for more to come. Until then, be brave, be kind, and stay awesome.